Hey guys, welcome to Rudrotech tutorial and in this chapter 4 of Angular 8 unit testing with Jasmine and Karma, we are going to look at Arrange, Act and Assert Pattern. Now, objective of this video is to understand what is Arrange, Act and Assert or AAA Pattern. Arrange, Act and Assert or the AAA is a common standard for writing the unit test cases and it has three sections first is arrange it means arrange everything to set up the unit test case like creating the objects initializing or mocking data etc then is the act section that means act on your unit test case meaning execute necessary functionality or methods that needs to be unit tested then is the assert section this part will verify whether the functionality or the method that we are unit testing is giving the result as per our expectation. In order to understand a range, act and assert pattern, I have prepared a class called customer reservation. So in this case, we are going to imagine a hotel which is having a hotel room capacity of 30 and it is having current customer count that is the customers present in the hotel as 10 and I have written a functionality that will help us to reserve the room. So in this case we are going to unit test whether a room is reserved or not. So here I have written a method reserve room which is going to return a boolean. If the room is reserved it will return a positive or a, that is the true value and if the room is not reserved it will return a false value. Now let's go and see the spec file. Now in this case I have prepared a basic code so that we can focus on our topic today that is AAA pattern. Now in this case I have written a test suit and a unit test case and the purpose of this unit test case is to test whether the rule is reserved or not. So in this case, the first thing is to arrange the object that is necessary for unit test. So first thing is to create the object for customer reservation class. I am going to create the object here. Here we have arranged everything that is necessary to begin our unit test case. Then is to act on our unit test case. So in this section we are going to act that is to execute the reserve room method. So I am going to write the code that will help us to execute the method. And since the method is going to return a boolean value, I am going to include a variable is reserve equal to now once the method is executed that means we have acted upon our unit test case now it is time to go to assert section now in the assert section we are going to assert whether the method executed is returning a result or a output as per our expectation so in jasmine we assert using expect. Now in this case, we are going to assert whether is result is true or false. So in order to assert that is result is true, we are going to use the matcher to be truthy, which checks whether the expected output is true or not. Now, I have already executed ng test on the local environment. I'm going to save this and you can see the result here. Now, one test case has been successfully executed. Now, let's go and see the output. Yeah, so the test case has been executed successfully. So, in this case, we have arranged our object, acted upon our required method. 
and assert it whether our output is as per expectation. So this is how arrange, act and assert pattern works. I hope you have understood this chapter. If you do, please like, please provide us comments and do subscribe. Thank you.